Who's in here? What are you doing? Just working, man. Me and Jay Campbell getting shit done, dude. Yeah, so when I first sit with this dude that we have a mutual friend that we kind of know, or that we know, and he's like, hey man, you gotta talk to this Jay Campbell guy. He's like, dude, you guys, you guys have so many similarities. So it was like literally supposed to be like a 15 minute call. <laughs> yeah. Fucking, I think like three hours later, we finally hang up. We talked about real estate, we talked about Everything. working out, we talked about business, we talked about fucking Everything. aliens, we talked about religion. <laughs> aliens, dude, I'm like, I, I got the phone with him, I go, man, I was like, how's your day? I'm like, fucking insane. <laughs> <laughs> so I just started telling her about it. <laughs> Like, I haven't even met this guy, but fucking love him. <laughs> it's badass. I don't hang out with cool motherfuckers. <laughs> when he talks, he just feels passion. Oh, yeah. The guy is, he's the people I want to be around, dude. Living like that now is all that matters to me. That's what's up. I don't judge people. I don't like immediately label people. I mean, I still work. I mean, you know, we all do at times yeah, we yeah, get mad. Subconsciously but talking. but but I I battle and I work fucking hard to not judge people. Cool. I I work super hard to not get mad. Like to just you know to be present, dude. Yeah. Just exactly. Here right now. now Here there now. is no yesterday. There is no tomorrow. There's now. Yep. You know, and I, dude, honestly, for 35, 36, 37 years of my life, I lived for tomorrow. Yep. It was all about like, oh, I gotta pay this bill, or I'm going on this vacation, or I'm doing this, or trying to get ahead, or I'm, you know, gotta make sure this happens. And it's just like, what the fuck? I always used to tell myself stupid stories about how like, I'm just not happy. I'm just not a person that can be happy. Yeah. You know what I mean? And it's just a bullshit story you tell yourself. I mean, there's no you. It's like I was saying to him yesterday. It's like there's no reason that you can't like live for tomorrow and be progressive in your actions and you know have you know fun saved for a rainy day and do what you need to do to live long and prosper. But you can't think about it all the time. Yeah. Oh my God! Not again, Bobby. Is that me? When I told you I was getting kicked, I got kicked out of Mountainside for personal training a guy. That was with me. He was, yeah, he was wow. training me. Yeah. Yeah. What? Well, how much did you have to lose, the dude? Uh, seventy-two pounds. Oh, seventy-two pounds. Yeah. Congratulations, Thank you. Man. Oh, what's up, peeps? Joshua Smith here with my homeboy Jay Campbell. What's up, guys? Just uh, wrapping out a pretty gnarly last couple days, man. Jay's uh, it's almost five o'clock here Friday evening. He's been in town since Wednesday about ten o'clock at night, and he's been grinding, punching out, and cranking out a lot of epic content. He's got to jump on the bird tonight around nine. Yep. And I got to jump on the bird around 5 a.m. tomorrow. Um, I'm going to Michigan, then uh, Illinois, then Canada. Um, but yeah, it's been, dude, it's been freaking awesome, man. I, I can't, uh, I don't know if there's really any other venture that I've been more excited about than what we're doing um, here, dude. I mean, this is just, this has been so life changing and life altering. Um, you know, and I know we both have massive passions for it, so it's been, been a fucking epic time. And I'm just humbled and excited and just super thrilled just to be in part room with Josh. I mean, you know, we, we built an amazing bond two years ago when we first met, and now we finally actually met in person over the last two days. It's been epic, you know, from the moment he walked into the room and saw me, we hugged it out and wrote it out, and it was just like, you know, we already knew each other. Like, there wasn't even like, oh, wow, you know, it's so nice to meet you. And we already had that feeling, but, but yeah, man, just like Josh said, you know, the, the personal healthcare space is like ripe for, tape, ripe for takeover. Um, it's just it's just sitting there, you know, doctors really aren't organized, they don't really understand how to market correctly. Um, there's so much that can be done on the hormonal optimization and just living a hormonally balanced life and I'm just excited, man, beyond belief to partner with Josh and you know, change the game literally in that space. For sure. Thank you for watching. You guys, um, the TRT manual, the testosterone replacement uh, of, I probably should read the fucking title. <laughs>
I do it every time. How many times did I do it in the first yeah. two years? I can't even say my own fucking thing. Yeah. <laughs> well, I'm not even going to say it, dude. I was going to say the TRT manual. So, uh, there we go. What is that, my peeps? Joshua Smith here. Hey, guys, I wanted to create.